Hello maths fans! A very special video for you today as I will be giving you a tour of my new studio here at the Oxford University Department of Continuing Education. It's right behind this door but first I need to unpack. All right, recording, recording. Let's get on with this then.
Right, I think that's it. Let's take a look. Ta-da! Beautifully unpacked and tidy filming studio slash teaching office. Now let's take a closer look. Starting, of course, with the blackboard. You can't completely see it at the moment as the blackboard is obscured by my rather large monitor slash TV, but you can probably just about make out there at the top the usual Tom Rocks Maths chalkboard writing. A little bit damaged as you can see from the move, gonna have to rewrite that one. So we've got the blackboard on the wall, you can see my rather large TV screen in front of it which I use for doing online talks. You can see my cameras over here, so the new Sony Alpha 7 III 4K camera with its external monitor. Then we've got my good old trusty Canon, I think this is the 70D if I remember correctly. Oh, it's the 80D, I got the updated model um, there on the tripod, also with my teleprompter screen attached to it. Um, various lights and things over here. Uh, quite a lot of lamps. You'll notice there are a lot of lamps in this room. It's all about getting that lighting correct. We've also got my display here of running medals. So on that little sign that says marathon, they are not all marathons. Uh, the most recent edition, this is the, uh, the 10K that I did in Rio a month or so ago, where I ended up somehow finishing sixth. There's also a couple there, the, uh, the Boston Marathon, sorry, the Chicago Marathon getting ahead of myself. Boston is hopefully next. The Chicago Marathon in there, along with a few others. You'll notice the giant hoop. If you've seen my video I filmed with Duolingo, that is the hoop I used when I was taking the perfect penalty that we had built. There's the door I came in. You can see my Pokemon teddy bears up at the top, along with various tubs. Uh, many, many folders. So these are folders of all of my work. I'll zoom in to show you a little bit. Uh, you can see down there we've got various notes and things to do with my PhD and teaching. Then we've got some books, a whole host of different things there. We've got some more folders to do with marking and PhD stuff. A couple of little models there. You've got Boba Fett's helmet and the Duolingo Owl, which is a thank you for my video with them. Uh, more empty folders that are gonna soon be filled couple more toys, nice little uh, Lego Friends set and also Darth Vader and also part of Hogwarts, haven't finished that yet, need to find the time. Uh, more books and a couple of models there, 3D printed models of the Titanic. So very well decorated bookshelf I like to think. Moving over to the desk, so we've got my Mac, my computer, my printer, the, uh, the Tom Rocks Maths branded merch. We've got my picture frame here, which contains all of my old tickets, for various concerts and music festivals back in the day when you got tickets. Now they're all just electronic. Um, also some nice Lego flowers. Big fan of these because you don't have to water them. Um, some more props and things in this corner. So this bag is actually filled with um, polydron, I think they're called. Big plastic shapes that you build together to make some model platonic solids. The, uh, the Spongebob cushion, pride of place. Um, the other desk over here, a couple more monitors, uh, reading stand, laptop, iPad, little map of the world. I need to add the pins of the places I visited. Haven't done that yet since I moved. Um, we've got the other monitor here. So this monitor on top of this filing cabinet, you'll see is opposite the blackboard. So that's the one I use when I need to see myself on screen. And the filing cabinet is just filled with various bits of filming and props I use for talks. Uh, we've got another shelf over here filled with cameras, filled with lights. You can see all the wires, various things plugged in. Um, more cabinets filled with camera stuff. More bookshelves. We've got my projector on the top, which I also occasionally use for online talks. My nice picture there of Lance Stroll uh, from the Racing Point, as they used to be called now, Aston Martin. Formula One team office. That was a gift from my brother who works there. Also got the uh, the YouTube Silver Award, which I need to hang back 
on my blackboard. Uh, then we've got, I say bookshelf, this is actually just filled with games. Uh, we've got all my various there, PS4, PS3, PlayStation 2 as well, Switch games, Wii games along with the dictionary. Uh, another cabinet, more lights, and then absolute pride of place over here, we've got my Pokemon card collection. So all of my favourite holograms from when I collected as a kid are all here, as you can see, listed in colour order. Going through, we've got the, the leaf, the electric, the fire, fighting and rock, psychic, water, and then just some of my favourite ones at the bottom. A couple of them are French. We've got some Japanese ones, various other things there. Um, more books. I can never have enough shelf space for teaching folders, all my notes and books all down here. These are the maths books and then down the bottom all of the, uh, the Jack Reacher books, which I'm slowly working my way through. They're always fun to read. Um, and then again, back to the TV, back to the blackboard, back to the cameras, and back out of the door. So there you have it, a little sneak peek behind the scenes in the Tom Rocks Maths Film Studio. As always, thank you all for watching. Please do remember to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I wish you all a very maths-filled 2024. Take care.